Hello everybody and welcome back to our channel. I'm Lynn and that's the old man. I just thought I'd put the camera on me, stop him talking. Doesn't stop him though really does he? So! Happy holidays folks. We are off to yet another rally, second one of 2024. Uh, we're going to Whitchurch, Bramblewood, Caravan Park, but it's on a rally. It's £15 per night without electric and £20 a night with electric. Yes, yeah, so, so we've never been there before, so it'll yeah, be interesting. And, and I've opted for electric. I'm happy with that. Anything to get another fiver out of me, people. Definitely, Anything. definitely. Ooh, so yeah, yeah, we are. We're stuck in traffic. I don't know about where all you lot live, but where we are, whatever direction you go in, you will come across roadworks. Roadworks every couple of miles. It's absolutely a joke and at the, the moment and the uh, the best thing about it, it's like i don't know a lot, a lot of the roads six months ago they uh, resurfaced them yeah and then they start digging them up again it's just unbelievable it really is unbelievable and it's not brilliant <laughs> sort of casting little kid yeah oh we're moving again oh no it is an absolute nightmare though really really bad at the moment with the traffic just letting a car out yeah it's uh, what normally takes me a journey of about 20 25 minutes to go and pick my granddaughter it's taking now an hour every time i'll go, go and pick her up that's uh, that's the most uh, annoying bit though and it's for anybody in, in uh, when they do roadworks you're queuing up for like 20 minutes and you get to uh, where they're actually working there's nobody there yeah there are a few people working around so but this uh we're in king swinford at the moment and this has been like it now Six months. Gotta be. Absolutely yeah. horrendous. Gotta be six months, yeah. But we're not moaning. Well, well I, I am. am. <laughs> we are. Yeah, fed up of it. Absolutely fed up of the roadworks. You're looking really pretty today. Shut up, rubbish. I'm very warm, actually. I've left my big coat at home and I've got my fleecy uh, jacket with me today. Talking about clothes, people. Oh. We've got some clothes to show you later. Yes, we're doing. We're going to do a fashion show. Yeah. Me and me pants. No. No. Me mankini. Oh God, no. Yeah, we've got to, we'll do, uh, we're going to do a fashion show at some point over this weekend. Yeah, and we'll also be announcing the... Uh, oh, the winner of the bike. That's, yeah, yes, looking forward so to that. Yes, all those who have entered, thank you so much. Yes. It's, we, uh, we, we were literally all uh, night. Answering comments. All night. And most of this morning. Yes. And what broke it up last night was we had a phone call from a very irritating person. Amber. <laughs> she can talk for England. Jesus. She phoned me up for a quick question. Two hours, seven minutes and 22 seconds later, I managed to get her off the phone. At, what, at one point, we just put her on loudspeaker, put the phone on the side, put the telly on. <laughs> but while we, were, while we were at that, we just want to wish Pete a happy belated birthday for the 13th of March. Yeah, Pete Poyle. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Happy birthday to Pete. Happy birthday, dear Pete. Happy birthday to Pete from Robin Lynn on tour. Your, work, your singing gets worse. Right, we will continue on our way. And uh, I'll right, pick you up. Hang on a bit. If I see you. Yeah, this is you right, mate? Watch your channel. Oh, do you? Brilliant. <laughs> Just a fella shouting that he watches our channel. Bless him. <laughs> Brilliant, man. Love it. <laughs> yeah, well, crack on, people. Yes, we'll see. See what's what. And maybe this weekend oh. I shall also have a snog. But the one thing you're not happy about, we're on grass. Aren't you? Aren't you? We're not happy. It's electric, but it's on grass. Don't you want the camera pointing at me or something? It's, you can see you. Yeah, but I want to see more of me and they want to see oh, more of me. Don't. See if I can put it down there. They don't like it too close, do you? Do you? No, who does? Body. <laughs> right, I'm going. Wow, look at this. You don't see that every day, do you? Man, that's old people. I bet you remember riding one of those as a nipper. Shut up, you Todd. Well, so we are a third, 300 yards away. Are you sure? Well, that's what it says on there, and that's what it says on my phone, because again, I'm having to take the two, use the two. Rather narrow, very pretty, and it's dried up a bit. Thank goodness. 
Yeah, we have drove through some rain, folks. Yeah, it's we are right close to the Midway truck stop in Whitchurch, where when our children were little and we used to go to Wales a lot, we used to always stop there with a the caravan, haven't we? Every yeah. time we went to Wales, we went on the A41, stop at the Midway truck stop, best breakfast in the world. I don't know what it's like now. Yeah, because we used to go to uh, Prestaven Sands a yeah, lot. Yeah, used to go to Prestaven Sands. There's the yellow sign for the Shropshire DA. That's who we're with this, this week. Um, yeah, as I said on the last video that we did, whichever DA that you are affiliated with, you can use any of them all over the country. So you haven't got to, yes, you've no, because, said that. Yeah, because people always comment and say, I'm in so and so DA, can I use it? Can I do what you know? Yeah, of course you can. You can go anywhere. That's a rather big puddle. It's a good job I'm not walking, I might drown. <laughs> yeah, you can pop it in you. Give us a kiss. Just a profit. I see you rookie like tango man again. Happiness! That's me. All about happiness. You would disagree, wouldn't you? It's very nice out here. Bloody bus is filthy, I know that. And that little stream, whatever it is, is very high. We haven't had some rain. Haven't, haven't we had some rain? I can't wait for the sun. We need some warmth. But it is forecast to get to 15 degrees this week. Woo. It's 14 degrees then. Is it really? Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Sick man. Shut up, Robert, you idiot. You great big knob. Bramblewood Caravan Park. Caravan and Camping Club site. But we're on a rally, so we're on a field. But we need electric, I want electric. First job, fill up the water. With his leaky watering can. Still hasn't oh, replaced chicken, it. Chickens, that's dinner sorted. No. Stay there, don't come under the wheels. Oh, I don't. Oh, yeah, we better go up there. there. That's where we're going. So I'll sort it out and see you in a bit. Well, folks, we're all set up. I've just done us a sandwich. Lynn's tripped the electric out once already. Yeah. We are lucky, though, because it's just started to throw it down rain. Just managed to get on the field, pointing downhill so we can get off easy. Over there in the barn, we can all use that tonight. Paint chairs over, and so everybody can get together and... Luckily, there's no karaoke. Good. Yeah. In that barn over there, apparently. I bet it's quite pleasant here in the summer. Mm. I don't think we can use the facilities. What facilities? The shower blocks and whatever, because it is a caravan and camping club site. Yeah, as long as we're going to help some points, all we need. Mm. I've just filled up with water. Perfect. Yes, with the hose pipe, not his leaky. What is it? Uh, water cap. Yeah, I've got one of those. Uh, Somebody sent it just, didn't they? Yeah, it's not very good to be honest. It keeps getting knots. That's because you don't put it away. It's a proper right? waste, uh, food hygiene rated one. Is it food? Yeah. Water height? I don't know. It's one of them anyway. But it's a rubber flat one. The only thing's a nightmare, isn't it? It is, because he doesn't put it away properly. If it was put I away properly. Put it, I did. I did. But you've got no patience. No, no, no. Rubbish. Absolute rubbish. I've got it on one of those proper holders, you know, round it all up, all nice and flat properly. Unwind it, put it on the tap, take it to your van, turn it on, it all goes in nuts. Why don't you put your little legs down? I don't reach. It does annoy me. You annoy me? Why do I annoy you? Sharp showers we're having today, folks. Sharp showers. Well, we're nearly, well, no we're not. I was going to say we're nearly into April, but No, we're, we're really not, Lynn. Two weeks off yet. I'm actually going to eat salad. I'll eat anything because I'm starving because you don't feed me. I'm hungry, so can you put the cat turn the camera off so I can eat? I don't like rabbit food. That's what salad is, isn't it? Bloody rabbit food. Well, you've got it again tomorrow. You trying to get me uh, on a healthy diet? I mean, look at me, I'm ripped. I don't eat to bloody watch what I'm eating. I can see car cars and vans getting stuck on here if it continues. We'll be alright though because we can just roll off here now. Yeah, it's okay pulling onto a field as long as you don't stop. If anybody wants to talk to you or anything, just ignore them. Get it in a position, you know you can get off. What? It's very true. What's the matter with you today? I'm, I'm, wait, I'm waiting for him to turn it off so I can eat. Have a bite. No, because I know you. Exactly. And the kettle's knit. 
are you idiot what this is what i have to put up with what oh no i just looked and there's water oh, all over quick the shut it up quick you knob this is what did you say get that mopped up woman what's the matter with you bloody hell he's just a walking a sitting disaster no i'm not you are it's a good job I noticed that. It's a good job. Oh, Lord. Yeah, because when we got here, the sun was out. It's beautiful. Red hot in here. So I opened that. And now look what I've done. There's none on the floor, is there? Yeah. No, Where? Don't worry, I'll get it up. Where? The same place that we had the, the leak of... What's it called? Look at the mess you make. You've only made a sandwich. At least I make some. Don't let none of that get on the sink. Odd! Oh, what a great night we had last night, folks. <sighs> yeah, I think we drank a bit too much, though. I think you did. I didn't. You did. I'm just looking at the bottles now. I feel a bit light-headed, though, today. I think it's a hangover. What an amazing night we had. We all went over to, I don't know if you can see it over there, the barn. Over there. We'll, we'll walk over in a bit now, see if we can get in. Um, and there was just music, but there was in there was the table tennis and that game. What's he going with the football? You got the little football Ta figures football, on. Uh, table, table football. Table football. Yes. Fantastic. I haven't played that. Well, for God knows how long. Since our kids were little and used uh, to go abroad, and then you'd get them in Spain, wouldn't you, in the hotels yeah. and whatever. God, it's such great fun playing table tennis <laughs> and playing that table football. Yeah. You know I mean? he, he was, and I won. Yeah, but he was playing me, and because I scored three like on the trot, he more or less picked the table up and... No, I played two blokes and I yes, beat them. but he, he didn't beat me. You stormed off in it and had a tan tantrum. No, because you were cheating. I wasn't. I never cheat. Anyway, it's good fun, folks. Yes, we had a good night, but tonight we're stopping in. To watch the rugby. So now we're going to have a little walk around. Yes, as I was saying... Uh, we're going to have a couple of snogs before we go, go and have a walk round. Definitely not. No, I feel, I'm feeling a little bit fragile, so I need to get some fresh air. Go for a nice walk. The you weather... shouldn't drink so much, should you? She gets no. excited, you know, when she's around people. Because <sighs> she doesn't get out much. I get out. I'm, all, I'm always out. Shut up, Robert. Um, I forgot what I was going to say. You one of those need, days, You isn't just it? didn't need to stop it. You just didn't need to eat it. She hates that, you know, you squeeze on and eat. <laughs> oh, and we've got the fashion show to do, haven't we? Or dig her in the ribs. Stop it. <laughs> Knock you out. Spark out. Right out. <laughs> we are, yes, we're going to go for a walk. We'll see if we can get in the games room, whatever, it, the barn. Is that top glued to you? Uh, I'll put it Why back on. Why do you keep on. putting it on? I love it. It's so cosy. But we are going to do it. We've got some clothes to show you. You might have yeah. seen a few on Facebook and Instagram. Yeah, I've got a, a, a new mankini I want to share with you, folks. It's not happening. And Kevin, please don't send him one. And show them down new stickers. What are they? In that cupboard up there. Why have I got to get up? Because you're What's closest up with your to little it. Links? You're closest to it. Come oh, on. she can't reach your cupboard. <laughs> we have got new stickers and they're not round like everybody else's i'm just looking at stickers on the door now <sighs> i want to put one somewhere maybe on there oh here we go give oh, it to you better do it look all you got to do is that bit there look oh. look at our amazing new stickers Let's have a look don't they union jack wow proud to be british yeah so We've, we will talk talk about this later. If you want any of our stickers or any of our merchandise, I will. I'm going to put the the URL, the link in the description below for our new shop with all our new merchandise. Yeah, yeah. Well, we'll go into that again later. Yeah. So come on, let's go. I've got a headache. I've, I've got, dehydrated. I've, I've got a permanent headache living with you. Shocker. Let's try. True though. Phones are going off. It's got to be that Gary. <laughs> uh, yeah, can we talk about Gary's uh, van? I think so. Yeah. Uh, a few months ago, a friend of ours called Gary. Well, he's not actually a friend. He's just an irritating person. But he's, he, though, him and his uh, lovely wife Jill have got a buccaneer. Yeah. Buccaneer what? It's a 
caravan. Cruise, is it the cruiser? I don't know, it's a buccaneer anyway. I can't remember which, which model it is. We've, and if we, you go we back have showed you on it a few times. Yeah, if you go back on our vlogs, because he had uh, a fracture on the roof and it was uh, leaking in water. Mm. So, cut a long story short. Well, no, they, he got in touch with the insurance company and they arranged for someone to come and collect the van. Yes. And they, they, they picked it up. Yeah, they then because they the couple hadn't heard about it, so they got in touch. Said, "Where is it? Can we? You know, they wanted to go up and see what it, where it was and, and what was going and on. What was going on? And they went up and it was stored in an outdoor storage area. So you can imagine the water coming in because it's been God knows how long it's been outside. Yeah. So absolutely gutted for them. I just can't believe what's happened. So the insurance company well, sent. sent uh, Gary and Jill got in touch with the insurance company again and said, you know, what's happening? So they, they, the insurance company sent somebody out and they've basically written it off. Written the van off? Gone. Scrap. Unbelievable. Absolutely gutted for them, we are. Yeah. I mean, you know, they, I mean, they're like mid-late 70s, so they can't bloody... You know what I mean? It's heart, heartbreaking. Sorry, Jill. Huh? Not sorry, Gary. But you know about that? People don't care, say these people, these insurance nobody, companies do not care. Nobody cares because at the end of the day, it's just a job. Yeah. And they go home at the end of the day, they yeah. don't They don't care. But it's their pride and joy, like, you know, like this is our pride and joy. Yes. Yeah. And I'm sure your van's your pride and joy, if you're lucky enough to have one. So, yeah. Gutted for them, absolutely gutted. Anyway, we're going to crack on now, people. Rant over. Shut up, Robert. Come don't on, give us a stop. tongue. No. <laughs> Rude. My tongue's like sand, babe. I don't know why my phone keeps going off. Yesterday, I just thought, I know this is totally random, but yesterday we were We're like being here. a bit random. We were watching, watching TV, weren't we? And then my watch, or my phone, because oh, my watch isn't on, um, just said, you've, how, do you, how do you feel after you woke up? Apparently I had 32 minutes sleep and I was sat watching the TV. Weird. Anyway. I had 10 minutes sleep. You bloody you snoring. I could be gone. Oh, I did have a... I sleep better in this in the motorhome than I do anywhere. I woke up. I thought there was a wild boar outside. No, it was yourself. Hey! <laughs> Stop it, because you bru... Hey! My knees will be bruised. Don't I'm be getting silly. old now. Never as old as you, though. That bloody old tea bag. All right, come on, let's crack on. <laughs> right, so I finally got her out of the van, folks. So we're going to go for a nice little walk. On this rally, there's about 15 vans. That's all that's here. 16. 16? I've just counted them, 16. Bloody hell. Yeah. And we have in the middle. And that's exactly where we are. Bramblewood camping and caravanning. Come on, chop chop. Do a bit of jogging. Jog, go on. I can't, I'll hurt my hip. You've heard your hip? Yeah, I think it's all the time the tires keep falling over. <laughs> That's a bit unusual, isn't it? Yeah, we're just walking. Walking, yeah. walking, walking. Yeah. You've got a house there. And then a teepee. Pop up. Yeah, so maybe you can vent that. It's about, I don't know, 200 yards away from the site. Yeah. Just there, look. How good's that? Happy with that, folks. Happy. Sheffin. Oh, it's a calf. Is it a calf? Yeah. yeah. Oh, wait, it's a calf there, look. Hold on then. Let's go and have a look at There you go, folks. So, just outside the site, you got a little calf. But, unfortunately, I've got no money on me. I'm sure they, I'm sure you can pay by car. Come on. That is so... Quick! Random. What? Just having this in the middle of nowhere. Really, isn't it? And then right opposite, you've got uh, a nature reserve, which we are going to investigate. Oh, wait, look, it's a bit muddy. It does look a bit muddy. It's very muddy. It's very, very muddy. I think we'll skip that. Will we? Okay. I don't want to get the dogs all muddy. Maybe we could lose. Yeah. No, I don't want to get the dogs muddy either. They've got to go back in the bloody van. Oh. Yeah. That must have been those wings. But it's still growing. It's got new leaves on it, look. Well, it's got a water supply and it's got roots. You can take it home and repot it. 
thing. It's like being in the twilight zone. Do 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 do. <laughs> Wayne, look at that. Absolutely stunning it is here. Just like you. Shut up, Robert. Okay. Didn't expect it though. No? And I just can't get over that random coffee shop. <laughs> I just think it's absolutely stunning. Oh. It is, but what we should have done, it's got the scooters out. And there's a car. And there's a bloody car coming there. I don't know where to stand. You don't know where to stand. Quick, quick. There's something wrong with my old bird, you know. She just said. Let's have a game of hide and seek. Yeah, you go off and hide, and then I'll go back to the motor home. <laughs> Unbelievable. Oh, what a, it's just lovely to be out, isn't it? It's great to be alive. You're walking in the countryside. Hand in hand. No. Snogging. No. No. Oh, uh, I haven't got my rugby shirt on again. Dutch doesn't look very impressed. No. She's, uh she doesn't like walking much now, it's her age. My well, to be honest, not dry. We just take it slowly, we just go for a... A she, little stroll. Yeah, she is, I think her back legs are starting to go. Yeah. It's falling over, doesn't she? Yeah, but you know, she's eating and drinking. And sleeping a lot. I wish I could sleep as much as she does. You do? I don't. You do? I don't. You're always asleep? Don't too slow for the camera. <laughs> Yeah, unbelievable. Cool. Yes, I just found out the place is called Brown Moss Nature Reserve. You didn't just find it out, I just told you because there's a big sign over there. <laughs> oh, dear, oh, your dog's doing it again. Has it had a ball to you or something? <laughs> Why are you filming my dog having a poo? <laughs> That's a shame, isn't it? It is, isn't it? I've got no money on me. That's nothing new, is it? We, our first house that we ever bought, that was the first plant I ever planted in our back garden, a bleeding heart, but I've never seen a white one. Yeah, Aww. well there's an honesty box there, look. Yeah, well I am honest so I'm not going to take one. <laughs> no, I'd buy you one if, I, if you took apple pie, but it doesn't. Is that, that's a primrose. Primer. <sighs> Potted. Lynn is seriously into plants now for some reason. She never plants. shuts up about plants. Do you? No, and it's like, you know, it's meant to be, isn't it? We're going for a walk and there's plants and I'd, I would really love that bleeding heart. Have Do you got, want me to go back and get some money? Have you got any cash in the motorhome? Yes. I've got a five pound note, so you'd have to put a pound to it then I can have two pots. No. Gutted. Lynn's just having a look how far Whit Church is from here. One mile. It's a mile. Well, that's the railway station. Yeah, because you just noticed a sign there. Ash Magna and Whitchurch. Bloody hell. I've already walked 10 miles. Unbelievable. Then, come on. This is becoming past the joke now. This is everywhere we go. There's a picture of me and Lynn. You're not even funny though, are you? <laughs> And you can't go on your scooter around because your maximum speed is 20 miles an hour. Oh, there you go, slow. Have your dog. No, we decided not to walk into Witch Church because. Of Dutch? Yeah, the dog is going to suffer. Yeah, because it's another one and a half miles. Yeah. And we've done about two miles. So, you know, you're talking like six mile walk with the dog, and I don't, we don't think she's up to it, so. No, so we're going to turn around and. Uh... Head back. Let her have a rest. Yeah. I think we should stop at the coffee shop though. I'm sure they'll take apple pay. I don't see the point in stopping at the coffee shop when we have got coffee and tea at home. Isn't it nice? In the motor. Isn't it nice to support a business? Yeah, of course it is, but I've got no money on me. Well, I'm sure they'll use apple pay. Ah. No, they don't use apple pay. You don't know. I do know, they've got no internet. They have got internet. He's, just, he's trying to come up with an excuse and it's sadly not working. And I'm going to go and ask and see if I can use my watch. No, you're not. Yeah, you are. Unbelievable. Lynn? What? We should have bought your rubber ring <laughs> and your armbands. Oh, are you going to be okay? Yes, I am, but Mavis isn't. And she's absolutely... Can you get the camera on? Look at the state of her. 
Oh, You're going to need a snorkel. Come here, Maeve. Oh, I've got to pick you up. Oh. 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 Quick. I need Welly. Are you just looking at these ducks? I don't know if his camera will pick it up, but... Those two ducks over there, I don't know if the camera will pick them up. They're not mallards. I know they've got green heads, but they're not mallards. I just wonder what they are. Ling's trying to find out now. Head up. They're bigger than mallards. I can eat a bit of crispy duck. Oh, yes. Can't be. I've tried on Google Lens, but... No? No. Well, what a beautiful little area. It is, and I was just saying, spring is so lovely. I mean, I know the sun's gone in now, but just to see new life, new leaves. Yes. Looking forward to another year. New blossoms. No. Leaves. New leaves. Yeah, it wouldn't, couldn't find out what the duck was. It's just nice. Just perfect. Just like me. No. Right, we're back. We just, oh, here's the lights. This is the area we were sat in last night, which was absolutely ideal. Actually, those are our chairs. <laughs> I forgot we'd actually left them in here, so it's a good job I came back. Yeah, I'll turn that off. It was ideal. I mean, you've got a microwave there, fridge. And then you've got your table tennis, table football, dartboard, and an area to sit. So, yeah, it was really, really good last night. Push that too. And you've got the toilets, which they've just painted. So yeah, all's good. Did you have to do it? Get off! Right, today's the day we're actually going to put the stickers on it, on the motorhome. We're back at the van, by the way. You know, it really hurts my eyes. Looking at that van? Looking, looking at white. Something white hurts my eyes, some reason. What's the matter? Shut up, Robert, and get on with your job. Let's stay to the bus. Absolutely minging. All right, folks. I've yeah, had these got... 12 months now. Yeah, we went through them all the other day. Yeah, I know. So I'm going to put for, forever retired on my garage door. You stand back a bit and get the, the door in. What's the matter with you? I can smell bacon. Yeah, me. And it does smell very nice. There you go. And I think I've just felt a spot of rain. Yeah, me too. Yeah, well, I'll leave you out here with your stickers. Hey, ho, let's tow. So there you go, fellow YouTubers. Sorry about the delay, but you are now on my garage door. Obviously, I need a lot more. And obviously, I've had to put ours on. I'll put one of ours on. These. What? These. Oh, you want to put one of those on? Yes, I want to say. Any time today, then I've got work on Monday. And that's our new sticker, which I'm very happy about. Yeah, my plans are to fill all that up with stickers and the other one. It could be done. Dutchie's dying to get in the van now because he's absolutely knackered. Uh-oh. Watch you don't fall out of there. It's high for you, that is there. Shut up, Robert. So what are you cooking me, my little angel, for my lunch? Well, these are... Tesco's hot and spicy mini fillets, so I thought I'll put them on a sandwich with mayonnaise and some salad. You have your one? Yeah, might have to do it in two lots, but. That right. matter, does it? So it's 200. Come on, hurry up. I'm hungry. Right, while I'm waiting for my lunch, well, while I'm cooking lunch, I'll just take a couple of minutes to do a very quick show, did. Go on then. Uh, it is two. Trudy Bowen for the 19th of March uh, from your husband Wayne Bowen. So happy birthday from us. <laughs> Wouldn't be the same, would it? <laughs> happy birthday to Trudy. Happy birthday, dear Trudy. Happy birthday to Trudy from Rob Allen on tour. We'll what? see you in July. Yeah, I think we, uh, we came back at the right time, didn't we? It's raining. I'll tell you something, you're looking a bit of a right today. Oh, shut up, you bloody idiot. What's the matter with you, man? I yeah, know, I'm yeah. not very impressed with that picture you just put on, on Instagram and Facebook. I think it was funny. 
Everywhere, everywhere we go, we always see a picture of us. Yeah, you filmed it just. It's not funny though, is it? I mean, for a start, the fella on there is slim. <laughs> right. Unbelievable. I've got to say, I know we did. Uh, we mentioned it the other day, but that little air fryer is perfect in here. Absolutely it really is. perfect. Can't hear it. Well, it's a slight hum. Great. Yeah. I like things quiet, oh, if you know what I mean. I wish I could have things quiet. What's that mean? It's quiet when you're at work. Unbelievable, folks. Please, don't, you're not going to retire, are you? Ever. Probably not. Can't afford to. Very true. Like right. most people. Right. Uh, Oh, come on, give us a snog. So what do you want on this? It's, you know, when I'm in the in the, uh, in the the motor room, I'll get like another lease of life. I'm going. <laughs> Four minutes left. Unbelievable. Yeah. I'm going to stick the camera up. Wow. Yeah. Make sure it's cooked through there. I don't want to be pulling. It will be. 18. Have you got your thermometer thing? No, I have. I ought to get one for in here because it's... Yes. Uh, they are very, very useful. Look at that, folks. Absolutely amazing. Do you want any? I mean, these are hot and spicy. Do you want any? No. Hot sauce? No, because those are spicy anyway. Okay. I've got my mayonnaise on, so I'm happy. That was very nice, my little angel. It Beautiful. Was nice. It really was. Uh, leave that. I'll do that. Yeah, it's done now, isn't it? Oh, you should have left it for me. Yeah, very, very pleased with that. It's, uh, it's going to come in useful, mm. isn't it? Why is there a bin bag on my seat? I don't know, because you haven't took it to the bin. Give us a kiss. Let me think about that one. No. Right, folks, we are very excited to announce the opening of our new shop. Yes, if you saw... And uh, before you go any further, can we just say, we don't make one penny from the shop, no, no. money whatsoever. Okay? No. It's just to help a business out. Yeah. So, yeah, I hope you will join us in, in supporting him, uh, Mr. Kevin Davis. Yes. Get off. As you probably saw on the sticker, we have not rebranded. We're still the same, but he's come up with that, the, uh, the British, the British, the UK. I can't get my words out. <laughs> The map of the UK. The map of the UK. There Come we go. So yeah, that will now be on all of our merchandise. Yes. So I'll... you can get a get a mug if you want one. I will put the the new link to our new shop in the description, and yeah, hope you will join us in supporting. Give me a new URL. So that'll be all in. So all I'll in just... the description, people. Yes. So we're going to show you a few of the things that you can buy on our shop. Lynn's going to do a bit of modelling first, and then I will do it. Clay modelling. <laughs> <laughs> so Lynn is now going to take a kit off to get changed into our merch. <sighs> Shall I do it here? No. <laughs> okay. hand. No. No, they want to see Stop. me interesting you. Nobody wants to see that. I'll do it off camera. <laughs> <laughs> well, Lynn is standing over there now, taking her clothes off for some strange reason. It's not a pretty sight, folks. <laughs> Man, it's a good job you didn't do that on camera. Yes, I know. <laughs> oh, go and sort your hair out. Nah. Right, are you ready? Am I? Are you going to give us a few twirls on that? No. <laughs> there you go. Three, two, one. Here she is, my little model. Ta da! <laughs> yes, this is, I'm sport today. I'm sporting a new range of clothing from Robin Lynn on Tours' new merchandise shop uh, with a new logo. She's outside, yes. Nothing on the back of this one. So, yeah, the next on the list is the uh, new beat, the new hat. Right, so that can see the bloody badge. I don't want to do it. I there, don't you go. there you go. Oh, don't you look cute. And the next on the list is the so beautiful, the beautiful, cosy. They do come in different colours, obviously. And Kev And I must me, say, those, fle those fleeces are quality. They are. He did ask me us what colours we'd like. I'd be careful, I don't make up on it. 
uh, and I chose baby pink because as you all know I do love pink. Perfect. And there is another t-shirt. I'm not going to take my clothes off and put another t-shirt Oh, on. please do. And that's <laughs> the... So this t-shirt I've got on that's embroidered, isn't it? Yeah. 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 This one is printed. Brilliant. And one of my other... Well, actually, it's my favourite thing ever. In the world. Yeah, I mean, as soon as we got here yesterday, I got it on. You probably saw a picture of it on Instagram because I put it on yesterday. She'll be back in a minute, folks. And I didn't take it off all night. <laughs> and this is my changing robe. Ugh. Yeah, all night last night. She had that on. I did. Absolutely love it. That's embroidered on the front. Yes. I have wanted something like this for so long. And does it feel quality? It does. It's absolutely, I love it. Like, well, like we've just said, I put it on yesterday and I didn't take it off till I went to bed. It was lucky I didn't actually sleep in it. Fleece lined with a hood. Oh, so cosy. And you've got inside. Pockets. Yeah, you've got zip pockets in there. You've got a big pocket in there. Put your hood up. Brilliant. Mm. Absolutely brilliant. <laughs> so that's me over and done with. I hope you enjoyed my little fashion show. So now it is time for the Village Idiot. <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievable. There you go, folks. Nice embroidered badge on the front. Nothing on the back. Hang on a minute. There you go. Shut up, Robert. <laughs> and we also have another t-shirt with nothing on the front and our badge on the back. How good is that? Round necked t-shirt. Perfect. They, we, I have got to take them home and get them washed and ironed because we've literally picked them up yeah. and uh, on the way out in a huge box. Yes. And I've got my beanie. Which you might have seen the other day on Instagram. I like that one. I'm so handsome, ain't I? Shut up, Robert. Come on, get on with it. Yeah, so that's, that's the beanie. I was leaning on that box then. Uh, what else have I got? You got your hoodie. Oh, yeah. And here's my hoodie, which you know I wear a lot because I'm always in a hoodie. Well, most of the time. Well, then I am. No, you're not. I am. Are you? Mm -hmm. I'll be back. I'll be back. <laughs> there you go. Quality embroidered badge. Hang on, I'll just uh, do a twirl. See what I mean? I told you he was a village idiot. <laughs> right, now I want you to try on your... Fits me nice as well. It does. It's because I, I told him the, the right size. Yeah. What? Because if you'd have ordered it, you'd have thought that you were still 20 and you were a size, a medium. Or a large. I'm medium. You're an XXL now. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. No, so That's is XXL. your XXL. So is your butt. Right, get your. Just put your dry. Yeah, oh, can't yeah. call him that. Changing robe. Yeah. Now he hasn't tried his on. So he's got. He's got to actually fathom out how he unzips. How it unzips? It's just bloody zip, isn't it? Well, it's that you can unzip it from the top on the bottom. These are so handy. Yeah, you have to turn the camera off for a minute because I've got to get some kit off. Five hours, hang on, five hours later he's got his clothes off and he's got that on. It's like yeah. waiting for Christmas. Unbelievable. Yeah, so there's my... Changing robe. Dry robe. You can't call them that, that's patented. Right, okay, there's my dry robe. Changing uh, robe. And I can't, but honestly, because I've never put one of these on before, but as you can see, it suits me. But everything suits me, so. Uh, but it's so light. Is light. I thought they'd be heavy things, no. but they're not. They're not. And uh, yeah, and you can also tighten the sleeves up if you want to. Well, there you go, folks. I've just put my hood up just to do a full demonstration of how good I look in this fantastic robe. Well, I think you'll look like the Grim Reaper. <laughs> yeah, I was right. Perfect, aren't they? Yeah, so 
you know, if you're on, uh, lucky enough to afford to go on a side and you want to go and have a shower, Starkers, just put this on. Job done. That's what loads of people use yeah, them for. Yeah. And like last night, because we were outside yesterday, weren't we? Because Keith cooked pancakes, so yeah. we were outside eating, and I, I put mine on. And then, like I said, I had it on all night last night. Absolutely beautiful. Fleece lined, pockets in it. Perfect. Warm and toasty. <laughs> There you go, folks. So I want you all to go around looking like Prats, like us. The <laughs> I don't think I, I think they look really good. Loving the new shape. I, I like I like the embroidered badge on it. Yes, I know. More do. so than the print badge. Yeah. That's just personal taste, I suppose. Yes. One thing I wanted to ask all of you, lovely people. How uh, handsome does Rob look? Nothing to do with that whatsoever. Mm. We and the gentleman who is doing the the shop for us were thinking about doing a limited edition t-shirt for our race against dementia 2024 and selling the t-shirts and then um some of the money raised from that will again go to our charity yeah so what do you all think would you purchase one um i mean we can we can do them online and i think for the people that are coming to the show to the show to our charity event which is going to be a show oh yeah it is it's going to be amazing um yeah amazing then he could bring them because he's actually coming to our charity event as well and he could you could buy them there or you could order them online it would be lovely to see as many people as possible that are coming to our event yeah, yeah. in the race against robin lynn t-shirts yeah because that'll be put, that will be put, obviously be putting a bit of money back into the charity as well which would be fantastic yeah so yeah so let, let me know well let us know i love that color on you you look stunning you look so sweet and adorable and scrumptious I'll give him one of his tablets in a minute. <laughs> so the next thing uh, today, that or the last thing before we... We say our farewell. Yes, before we go. It's um, the winner of the fantastic, and I forgot what the bike's called. It is the Bodywell T16. It's a good yes. job. I know what we're doing. Sarcastic little kid. Okay, then. What? Where's the... Where oh, yeah. <laughs> Let's draw the lucky winner. And we did say, please come and get it as soon as you possibly can. We did. Oh, just have a Stop good looking. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, man. So the winner is... And I've got no glasses on. Amanda Marson. Amanda Marson, congratulations. You're going to meet me. Hopefully he'll be at work and you'll just meet me. So please, can you send us a private message, email, whatever, get in yeah. touch with us and then we can arrange for you to come and collect the bike as soon as possible, please. Yes. Pretty please. Yes. I just want it gone. Fed up a tripping over it. Yes. We w yeah, it's, uh, it's, got to, it's got to go. Brilliant. Oh, there's something yeah. seriously wrong with you. Yeah, uh, special massive thank you to Mr. Kevin Davis. Yes, Much appreciated. for Brilliant. sorting all yeah. this out for us. He's yeah. he's done an amazing job. We've been working on this for a few, well, on and off for quite some time now. We're trying to yeah. get it all together. Yeah. So but we the, can... the shop is now live. So yes, yeah. uh, it's uh, so you know exciting. And, and he's also going to do. Lynn doesn't know yet. A special edition T-shirt for all you ladies with a photo of my face on on it. Well, we won't sell any of those, will we? <laughs> Who's gonna want one of those? I was get, I was getting a bit worried when I got the mug out in case it, I got a picture of your ugly mug on it. <laughs> Bully you all. Yeah. So thanks for watching, people. Actually, if... one idea of a T-shirt, if you're watching, which I'm sure you are, Kevin, would be one with all the ass Logans on, shut up, Robert, and whatever. I'd like one of those. Actually, that could be put on the Race Against Dementia t-shirts. We could have some slogans on it. Let me know what you think, people, and then uh, yeah. we'll let Kev know as well. Yeah, but the shop is live, so yeah. Yes, so go and check it out. Uh, what was I going to say? If for some strange reason you do come across our channel, people. Please drop us a comment, because we always answer every single one back. But give us a thumbs up. Because it all does help. Uh, Hit the notifications bell. Yes, and that, uh, that notifies you then 
every time we put a video on so you can't miss it. And don't forget to subscribe because it helps our channel grow. <laughs> You just, you just oh, want, I love it, man. Love it when you, you say want, that. Yeah, you just Brilliant. want me to say that, don't you? Laugh, don't you? <laughs> Brilliant. Stop grabbing my knees. So on that note, people. No, we will, gonna... we will say our farewells. Do you want me to? I will drain you in coke. If you do, you get. You're... I'm not doing. I'm just saying. I'm, I'm boy, warning just... you. Okay. I won't. Any whiskey in that? No, unfortunately, there will be in a bit, though. In a bit. <laughs> yeah. So uh, on that note, folks, we you will say. You believe how many times we have to stop this and start again because somebody messes up. I do a lot. <laughs> so when we come back on and we're laughing, it's because he's messed up yeah. again. I don't know what's up with me. It must be my age. It is. Well, you are nearly sixty. Oh, we need that on the t-shirt as well, don't we? Because it's a special year. A special birthday. This sixty. You know, I can remember uh, the day I left school. Okay. During the war, <laughs> like it was yesterday. I can remember walking out the gates at school. Do you know how many times I've heard that? I can. Then. I know. That's you how quick your life me. goes. That's why you got to have a laugh and you got to get out there. You got to have a blast. You got to get hammered, and you got to irritate your wife to death. I keep telling our children this: just within a blink of an eye, you will be our age. Yeah, and we all know that's the truth. Yes. Yeah, so on that note, people, we will say our farewells. So stay safe for the caravan as motorhomes tend to drift the skies on you. We still love you. <laughs> we do. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you on the next one. <laughs> <laughs> uh, idiot. Idiot.